And just a comment before we go further, there is a statement on the labels of some veterinary products that the product isn't approved for dogs less than a certain age. So an example here is the label for Clomacalm, which says the drug, it, drug is for use in dogs older than six months. These restrictions can mean either that the drug had detrimental effects in younger patients or just that it wasn't tested in younger patients. And we can see for Clomacalm, if we look at the Freedom of Information Summary or the, more, the expanded labeling, that it wasn't tested in, in dogs that were younger than five months of age. So the youngest dogs in the safety study were five months old. And it seems like five to seven months age, if you look at a lot of these labels, is a common um, age for safety testing. Why is that? In the United States, at least, it's because industry guidance suggests using basically healthy, young, mature animals for safety testing unless there's a specific goal to market the drug for younger patients. And in some cases, there is. So, so for example, with a lot of parasite uh, control products. And here we have one of those, which is Revolution, is recommended for use in dogs and cats six weeks of age and older. Um, obviously, there are also some weight restrictions on some of these products, but that has more to do with difficulty subdividing tablets or um, reducing fixed doses that aren't specifically designed to accommodate animals under a certain weight.